Hi guys, it's Gav here from DartsPlanet.tv. I've not long been back from table tennis with my little boy. I've not been able to have my phone on me all night. Uh, we play in the table tennis league uh, every single week. And I've been so wanting to watch the Fallon Sherrick match against Ted Evitt. I knew it would be good. I knew she was a good player. The one with Mikuro Suzuki the other night was absolutely incredible. Now, I've literally just finished watching that and seen Fallon's incredible 3-2 uh, win. Um, it's now 1.15 in the morning, but I felt that I had to jump out here and do a video. As you'll see, I've not even got my Darts Planet TV t-shirt on. And I know that Fallon's win will change darts forever. Um, let's have a look at how Fallon won with her percentages and everything. She obviously beat Ted Everett 3-2. She had an average of 91.12. She had a, a 19 140s. She had 6 180s, 106 checkout, and a checkout percentage of 41.38, 12 from 29. Uh, most Dart fans have been behind sort of the ladies uh, getting the opportunities to play at the Worlds. Of course, we're going to have doubters, but for me, they should have been in ages ago it's just giving them that platform to show what they can do look at Anastasia last year Lisa Ashton like I said Mercurio against Richardson last night just losing out on the last leg you know really she sort of didn't you know could have won another set as Fallon could tonight you know missing four uh, doubles to get the second set but still to have that composure and belief that she could win on the biggest stage of all uh, she was just so calm um, incredible uh, and it's not only going to uh, you know increase the awareness even more for darts around the world it's going to be brilliant because there's going to be more sponsors that come along there's going to be more ladies that are going to be wanting to play the sport which means there's going to be bigger prize money um, and how many years is it going to be if the ladies keep getting these opportunities and showing that they can compete with the men before they are playing in more and more of the PDC majors uh, get, getting through Coos School because it, there really is no difference anymore more um and the more opportunities they get to play uh, the more they're going to be able to showcase what they can do i think the next five or ten years is going to be really really exciting but i am so pleased for fallon sherrick i cannot tell you let me know what you think in the comments below but guys please remember the date the 17th of december 2019 who fallon was playing ted everts because this is a question that will be asked forever in quizzes and all around the world and talking points um yeah i can't wait to see your comments i'm absolutely shattered i'm gonna have to go to bed i was up till five o'clock yesterday doing edit and it's really busy this time of year with christmas uh, if you do like my channel guys please subscribe don't forget to turn on your notifications and i'll catch you all next time go on fallon bye